Can you please provide two examples of your leadership failures uh, that you've learned from and that would help you ultimately uh, work better, represent this town and town house? I was on the um, um, board of directors of the Florida Academy of Physician Assistants a number of years ago and a topic came up that I I drove through fairly hard. I used, I, I actually I thought my leadership skills were pretty good in driving it. I'm not going to go into details on the topic because it's a little bit complicated, but as it turned out, and this goes back to my previous answer, my vision was flawed. And I, I, I had to come to terms with that and uh, come to grips with uh, not, not, every, not everything that seems like a good, a good idea is a good idea. And I think that I learned to sit back and try to re-examine, you know, my vision and the information that I have. And there's the whole garbage in, garbage out theory, which brings me to a few other issues about lobbyists and special interests and so on. So I think that uh, the, what I've learned most from my, my failures in the past has been really to clean up my vision and try to process information much better before I try uh, using whatever leadership skills that I do have to drive that information forward. Thanks. Do you want me to repeat the question? Yes. You can, okay. Please provide two examples of your leadership failures that you have learned from that you that would help you work successfully. I guess it would be the Indian River Lagoon Coalition. Maybe I just should have just done it and uh, and <laughs> and not uh, not try to uh, uh, get permission from the leadership, which is what you're supposed to do. That's what I've always been told you had to do. Um, you know, my, my leadership style, I guess, is somewhat different. I don't, I don't threat. I don't, um, you know, people don't look at me and, and think, wow, she's going to retaliate against me if I don't do something. That's, 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 just, that's not my style. Yeah. You know, I, it's, it's trying to build a coalition with people. And I think I have built coalitions with people. You know, maybe the coalition building, you know, I don't go out at night drinking with the buddies. I don't go out at night trying to, uh, you know, to... Uh, entertain people you know i work late and uh and i try to do what the people sent me up there to do so you know i don't know if, if any you know specific leadership failure that i might have done other than you know wanting to ask for permission to do something for my people i guess next time i won't ask permission i'll just go do it okay rich um you know it's 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 a tough one um My, we, we had a family business that, uh, and uh, you know, Larry, I, I, I hesitate because um, uh, I smell mailers at, at, to my left, uh, uh, what you say on an answer like this, you know. But I, I will tell you that my mother and father um, founded a business um, a long time ago, um, 95, and I came home from college with a degree in banking to, to, I got that degree specifically to work in the family business. And it was a very good business. It was a working mortgage company. It was a correspondent lender. So it was a uh, non-depository banking loan institution. And we grew to be one of the largest in Brevard County. And it, it was really doing very well. We, did, we didn't do subprime lines, lending. We didn't do the negative amortization loans. Um, my failure in leadership in that business was that um, during the good times, um, I didn't learn from my dad. My dad didn't save a dime. When he died of cancer, in 2008, in February of 2008, um, he didn't leave a, so much as a IRA for my mother. Um, and in, 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 in the peak of that business, um, my wife and I bought a house, you know, bought a car, um, and didn't do that thing that you, you learn in grade school. We put that 10% away or whatever. And so after the bubble and um, the business, everyone was struggling. Um, I learned a valuable lesson. So my failure in my personal leadership was that um, that failure to um, to plan for the worst. And I will tell you this: that will, that that kind of mistake will. Now I made it out clean, right? Paid off my debts, moved along, um, got a good job, but that mistake will never happen again. In fact, my wife and I um, uh, are very sincere about putting money into our four hundred one ks. We're going to make sure that there's a rainy day we have money in it. So it's a uh, Lesson learned, and that would, and, you know, it's a personal leadership fault. 